Uh, all right, playoffs underway. Uh, we had our four first four matches of the first round. I'm just going to go first round, second three, round. Three sweeps. Let's go. Three sweeps, one of them an upset uh, based off of rank, and, uh, and then three, I guess two more, just kind of generic what we thought were going to happen, and it happened pretty pretty stompily. So uh, I want to start there on the bottom side of the bracket. We'll, we'll get back to TSM getting dumpstered by Golden Guardians, but – uh, Dignitas and e in in Hundred Thieves, just kind of thanks for being there. Uh, what are your thoughts on this expanded bracket, and why did we have last weekend happen that long? <laughs> uh, they just wanted content for Ellis and I. They know that our channels are going to be dead come mm -hmm. like November, December. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. might as well just get in some like, extra <laughs> hours. You know, that's what they're it just is. hooking it up. Secret Agent Brian yeah. making it happen. Uh, Ellis, this this. We talked about it all year. Hey, expanded bracket. How's it going to work? Summer split or spring split doesn't matter. And now that it's here, it kind of just, it feels like the playoffs have now started, doesn't it? Yes. I mean, now it's starting to feel like the playoffs are here, but it still feels kind of weird. Um, I mean, obviously, like, it, so the, the, big, the biggest takeaway for me, though, is that Evil Geniuses seemed like they i mean they can belong almost in like the playoffs like i don't think that's miserable but obviously dignitas and hundred thieves it's like why are they why are they there sort of in, in a way I, I i don't know i mean though the, those two series were they were they were insufferable man i mean yesterday was mm -hmm. yesterday was something yeah. it was rough the I, I, I think i think those teams just don't deserve to be in playoffs like you watch the level of play and it, like even when they get, in my opinion, like a draft kingdom, they can still never win. Like, I thought game three from Dignitas versus TSM, like, you don't get, like, harder draft win than that, in my opinion. And then you still lose the fucking game. Like, like, like you get absolutely shit stomped. It's like, at that point, why are these teams even competing? Like, these teams can't win. There's no point of playing these games, so. I mean, 100 Thieves yeah. lost with Ocean Soul. Um, yeah, that's, after that's like dragging yeah. the and, what, and, 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 and Elder. Elder and Baron and Elder and, and Elder and Baron Ocean Soul Elder and Baron and they lost the game because for some reason Ryoma is just allergic to like winning or like building a QSS like I don't understand why you're playing against the TF and like sure you have spell but cleanse but maybe when it gets like the 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 point in the game where you're just gonna simply end you should probably buy a QSS when literally the only thing TF can do is gold card you at that point. Like, I don't know. I mean, somehow I guess like TF is just a better team fighter than uh, Zoe because no one's gonna be build QSS or like have a cleanse for it. Yeah, I, I want to find the moment because I remember uh, they they won a sloppy, messy dragon fight uh, down on the bottom side of the map. Then went to go get uh, dragons uh, or go get Baron. Uh, someday, someday died in the process. Uh, and I think that was the Ocean Soul fight. And I remember looking at Someday's face, and I was like, "Why doesn't he look happy? Like they just won the fight. They have Baron. They're gonna they're gonna s settle the score here." <laughs> and then the moment where your boy Rioma just walks forward right into a gold card inside their base after taking uh, uh, the inhibitor, and they just needed to walk minions in, and uh, the, the comeback was on for EG. Yeah, the comeback, man. What what a comeback! I, I just for some for some reason, uh, Ryoma was mind controlled to R directly into the TF. Like as long as uh, he doesn't do that, I'm pretty sure they just end. But I don't know, man. It, it's just too much. It, it's it's too much for me. And like I like the 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 at least the, the draft identity of like, hey, we're gonna like play like around like uh, theoretically when you look at the two players right if you're getting contracts in italy to spencer and graves like that should be winnable and then you're giving things that should set him up like in the first game he has a renekton he has a tf he has um oh his bot lane I don't, I don't think fit the draft i didn't like the tom kench there at all but like there is some like ideas going on there but at some point you need your mid laner to actually like turn on and like carry the game and it's just never happening there so like I, I really hope that, you know, some NA mids get a chance because there's no there's no world where I think that, like, mid laners, and I tweeted this, like, Palafox, Evolved, um, Ablaze Olive, like, all, any of those three, Insanity, who just who just who came up. like shot, so, yeah. Yeah, exactly. And Insanity, well, the, the thing that people don't understand is Insanity was not the person that looked like the best mid in Academy. 
mm-hmm. right? Like everyone would have put Palafox above him. Like Palafox, uh, one last split in Academy, looked really good in in the playoffs. Um, he's been playing uh, really well. They they are first place in the regular season in Academy. He is rank one in NA solo queue. Like this is a player that I want to see like have some, you know, so, somebody should take a shot on him at least. But and there would be reasoning for it because at least he won't take up an import sp- slot. Sure, if he crashes and burns like Ryoma, at least it won't be an import crashing and burning. So you already have that advantage there. So I'm just confused why teams are just allergic to trying out these players. Well, it's because they know best, Tom. Um, so just letting you know that. Okay. All right. Well, <laughs> okay. I mean, all I'm saying. <laughs> you know, <okay. laughs> Yeah, okay. not sure. Not sure what your lounge lat is, but doesn't place yeah. you in you know position to make these decisions. Yeah, that is, that's a fact. Like, I just talk. Oh. What do I know? Uh, I want to show everyone real quick the uh, the play that I was talking about. If you missed the uh, EG Hundred Thieves series, this is this is all you kind of needed to see right here. Uh, no, don't show the fucking minion. Are you gonna oh, show the minion? Is. Here it is. No, I'm, oh, oh no, please. I'm showing Rioma. Okay. Flash flipping forward right into golden glue. Oh, okay. Stunned, Good. half his XP, it's all like, gone. How insane is it though? I don't know. But like, what is, I don't even know. Oh what my is. God. Ah, make him stop. Yeah. I mean, I, I wanna, I wanna actually, oh, the, the real highlight though is how emotionless all of his teammates are to what he just did. Like, if, yeah. if there was, if there, yeah. I, I don't know how none of them realize like, you know what I mean? No, no, that's what you, that's how you know they just see this shit on the daily. Like they're just expecting that shit. They're like, ah, oh, fucking Tommy, fucking Tommy did it again. <laughs> like they, they just they, they just see this every single day in scrims, and nothing has changed <laughs> for them. <laughs> Holy shit! Another, another day at the job, a meteorite <laughs> falls out of the sky, <laughs> blows up someone on the bike. Like. <laughs> it's it's really messed up. Like. I mean, honestly, like the the best clip that I saw was uh, do you, uh, the the tweet. Do you want me to pull that up? Well, you can pull up the tweet, but the best thing from this tweet was looking at someday's face. Like somebody clipped someday's face when Tommy missed both skill shots on the super minion. Oh, I thought that was like the most telling thing. Holy <laughs> fuck! Oh Jesus no! Christ, it was too much. Oh, oh, no, uh, I don't. Dude. I don't see it. So for those of you that also, this was. <clears throat> This oh, was Portia. after they came back and had to. Uh, there, I, yeah. I, I hid. Oh, never mind. Mateus's face right there. Uh, yeah, whatever. Fuck it. Just trying his damnness to get the little bubble. Please, <laughs> just help. Uh, yeah. No, no, I can't. I can't. I mean, it happens, it's too right? Much. Like it happens, but <laughs> like maybe you miss one. Like missing both. Like oh, maybe it happens. I guess. Jesus. And I think this. And this was after. This was after he died and and gave it over, right? This is. No, I think this was before. Was it? Was it before? Did they give up? Did they give up their bot in? Oh yeah, that. I don't remember if they gave up their bot in hit before they uh, went in because I do remember EG punished. Uh, 100 Thieves for getting the third. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's before, it's before. Um, but anyway, uh, tough series there for Ryoma in game two.